uh, hello viewers in this video uh, i am focused on mathematica in which i am just uh, going to tell you that how you can uh, make a zoom plot in the same figure or you can say that magnify on the figure so i'll start with a uh, example in which uh, uh, you can say that uh, i have chosen the two uh, different lines which is almost coinciding with each other and uh, you can see that i am just going to zoom the portion on the graph and show it on the same uh, same uh, same figure so firstly i took a one function which is just uh, gx i took a gs function just like x square and another function you can say that h with same x square with is minor minus difference with this since the difference is very small and you can see that both this uh, functions if i plot this is almost coinciding with each other uh, so uh, now i wish to uh, plot this two functions and the syntax is i have to uh, write uh, gx sorry gx and h of bracket x with close sign and the domain of this i have chosen minus 1 to 1 so this is the syntax if i run this you can see that this uh, parabolic graphs are uh, plotted but in this graph the lines are not a single line it's actually two lines and coinciding very closely to each other and it's not easy to visualize but if you wish to focus uh, the portion near zero on the graph then uh, what is the syntax uh, what is the commands which you can use uh, one uh, one uh, important thing which i wish to tell you that you can size the uh, you can control the image size uh, just by uh, putting this command like if you can use tiny command and if you uh, run this uh, sorry image size is this you can use tiny is there and uh, you can also use small you can also use there is a command like large and if you wish to con uh, give your size you can put any number the 400 i have chosen this is the size uh, i uh, in order to make a zoom plot i i wish to uh, start with one command which is uh, famous in the uh, mathematica is the epilog command in this command what do you have to write you have to write epilog here so epilog syntax you should know you have to write this the inset uh, i start with inset now i make a new plot and which plot is same because uh, you are just focusing on the you are on the local region near zero so function is same you can use the uh, new variable like gy and another is hy so your variable independent variable is now changed but function is same and you can close this and you can start with the variable minus 0 0.1 so you wish to plot very near to the domain is near to minus 1 to 1 so this is uh, the plot which you wish to uh, is but uh, uh, the things which you keep in mind that you if you wish to have a frame so you have to write true or false so i have to write true here if you wish x is then you have to write true if you don't wish then you have to write false here so and what is the image of this so image size if you uh, wish obviously it should be uh, lesser than 400 so you can keep it uh, nearly one third of this so this is uh, your uh, command uh, of plotting command and if you on this plot bracket is now closed now you have to close this uh, epilog command so epilog command you have to give the coordinate where you uh, wish to place this new axis so i wish to place near 5 and 8 so i will give the coordinate this is actually the coordinate of the center and 
you just close this epilog command now you can see that there is two uh, plot uh, with, with the help of epilog command you have constructed and just now you have to run this now you can see that this new small region is now plotted so this is is now the zoomed version of this if you wish to change the position like if you wish to change the position to 6 run this it is now shifted if you wish to change the position 6 6 it is now shifted and wherever you wish to place it's up to you and it's very easy uh, in mathematica to place this so this is how you can this you can uh, make a zoomed plot of this variable and this is uh, all about of zooming or locally zooming the variable if you uh, like this video uh, please give your comments and i will give you more videos uh, on mathematica maple and matlab so thank you for watching this video have a nice day